Now, as the 35th edition of the Lagos International Trade Fair uh, was declared open Friday by President Mohamed Buhari and the Lagos State Governor Babashide Sonwolu, the President has advised uh, Nigerians to patronize Made in Nigeria goods and services in the 10 days of the networking and business transactions and beyond. Plus TV Africa's correspondent Destiny Momo was there to file in this report. This year's fair has been declared open. <laughs> Tafabalewa Square, venue of the 35th International Trade Fair, was filled with excited business individuals and activities to showcase goods and services that are unknown to many and happy customers hungry to be introduced to new products. The theme for this year's edition is connecting businesses and creating values. President Mamadou Buhari was represented by the Honorable Minister of Industry, Trade and Investment. He speaks on the need for Made in Nigeria goods and services to be patronized to ensure economic value and attract investment opportunity. Of wealth and value creation, it is imperative that as a country, we improve on the ease of doing business, increase economic activities, and ensure that the economy is diversified while still creating jobs for our citizens. One of the major policy thrusts we are deploying to drive the facilitation of trade and market access is the imminent revision of Nigeria's trade policy. Its revision will capture our current economic realities and our aspirations of further facilitating trade and access to markets, both locally and regionally, especially in the advent of the implementation of the Africa Continental Free Trade Area. Although Lagos months, Governor Sonwolu, represented by Lola Akande, informs on the economic importance of the trade fair as it concerns micro, small and medium enterprises and the opening of the border. Hence the fixing of Badagri Express to Okokomaiko access by the state, he commends LCCI for their doggedness. The importance of exhibition, trade fair, cannot be overemphasized in view of the envisaged impact on the development of the economic sector, most especially the micro, small and medium enterprises, MSMEs. We need to understand that for businesses to do well, we must add value. Let's also, in certain sectors, move away from this raw material mindset. You are in agriculture, you say you sell the raw yam. You are not pro uh, processing it into something of higher value. Let us, as a country, start refining our own petrol. Let us, as a country, start mining and refining what, refining what we bring out of the ground. Trade is the key driver of employment as Lagos International Trade Fair remains the big platform for the free trade area to ensure the economy is diversified. Destiny Momo for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.